everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivorian Spice back at it again with another match reaction. And remember guys, if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button, remember to share to everyone that you know, people that you don't know, don't care, share it because sharing is free. And right guys, today it's RB Leipzig 3, Manchester United 2, Manchester United dumped out the Champions League. Yes, guys, our story in the Champions League is finally come out at an end. Disappointing, disappointing performance from the guys in the first half. Yes, we are out. We are going to be flirting with Europa League, back to Europa League. If this, if Europa League was still on Channel 5, we'll be back to Chanel, number 5, the perfume, or the perfume. That's what we'll be representing, Chanel number 5. But luckily, we're on BT Sports, so which is not a bad thing. But yes, Manchester United, unfortunately, guys, we are out. I'm fuming inside. I'm hurt because at the end of the day, we had to stay up to watch this nonsense in the first half, especially. Guys, 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 what can we say? What can we do? What can we really say? We went out to RB Leipzig to defend. And I always thought it would be a dangerous game to go to RB Leipzig and play the defensive game and just defend to try and get a point. That's the worst thing you do, especially when we're not, we don't do great in the first half, especially in the last recent games. So, for Oli to actually go out there and just play defensive and play seven defensive players and concede two goals in 13 minutes, that's all on him. That's all on him. I'm wondering, does he set this team up properly defensively in terms of position-wise where they need to be? Because so I saw a lot of frailties and I've been seeing this for a very long time and I'm just tired of seeing this. I'm tired of being tired, you know what I'm saying, guys. Honestly, guys, although the players were not good enough today as well, faults do go back straight to Oli. And it's as well, he's at fault because he chose that team. He set up that team. He trains and coached that team. And today when I saw him on the sideline, it's all fake, guys. It's all fake. It's all fake. They look all half-hearted shouting out instruction. Barking instruction is half-hearted. What is it? You can't be a soldier. You can't be a soldier on the field, field and try and do things half-hearted. Never that. Never that, guys. But yeah, Oli and Michael Carrick, half-hearted boys. Can, can you imagine yourself? them barking information? I swear to God, they look like a bunch of pussies. No offense. You look like a bunch of pussies trying to spark half-hearted instructions. No, everyone looked at you and think, what the hell is he talking about? I don't know. All I can hear is meow, 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 bare pussy holes. But anyway, it's just atrocious, guys, that we've actually gone out the Champions League so early in the group stage as well. <laughs> I don't know what to say, guys, but it is what it is. Early out, as always. Early out. Straight into that first half. How can we concede in two minutes? And there has to be a bloody Manchester City pagan. Angelino out of everyone else. Screw you. Angelino out of everyone else. If right now, let me tell you something. Angelino, this is my middle finger showing right now, just that I am respectful on this channel. Really and truly, I would give you this, this shit. Dickhead. Twat. What a prick. Waste man. Pagan. Angelino, right now, I would just throw my boot at you. But anyway, it is what it is. You're a pagan. You're up. That's what you're supposed to do. Hurt us, right? Isn't that not true, guys? And then 30 minutes down the drain to concede another one, 2 nil. Poor defending, poor defending guys. Ah, uh, like I said before, how the hell can we have seven defenders? And concede two goals in 30 minutes. Hmm. Atrocious guy. By half time, I was just like every single one of you. We're done out here fam. We're definitely done out here. No hope, I had no hope. Like, I seriously had no hope, I was like, you know what? Wow, wow, this is on Oli. And the players as well. And then the second half started, again, we concede. And I saw Harry Maguire, Harry Beckenbauer, this 80 million pound, sh I'm about to say striker, because only strikers are supposed to cost that much. But this 80 million pound, full of a defender, cost us another goal. People will say, David De here, David De no, but no, it was Harry Maguire, and I pulled it straight on him. Harry Maguire. And then all of a sudden, did not read it, did not clear it, you know, did not fear danger. For 80 million, you're not even sensing danger, bro. Dogs do way better than you but in sensing fears and all that stuff. And you're just an 8 million striker. I keep saying 8 million striker. You see you, 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 you what I'm saying, sir? How frustrating. We paid 8 million for a defender. He can't even defend that word. He can't even sense fears. Dogs sense better fears than him, you know, and suss it out. He can't even sniff anything. 
You know, all of a sudden, the guy that everyone's hating on, Paul Pogba slash Harry Maguire, I don't know who's Paul Pogba had to pull in, ricochets off of Harry Maguire's, I believe his face, but still went in. The guy that everyone else is hating on, I know he wants to leave, he's declared it, but still, he scored, making it freedom, giving us a lifeline, a lifeline, some hope. But yeah, guys, we lost 3-2 straight up. Again, I cannot say this again and again, Wally out. Hashtag Wally out, bro. I've been Wally out for so long, like, and this is this is the tipping, this is the tipping bag right now. I'm out, I'm tired. Like my eyes are red, and I'm I'm just pissed off. Wally out, guys. If you're not with me right now, if you were satisfied with us always starting off badly all the time, 24/7, we're always starting off game badly, being behind, and you're with this, and you want to be like, oh, back the manager, no, back Wally, back Wally going to social. Wally's a goner, bro. Wally is out of here, man. Wally gonna show show your house, bro. Show show yourself out of here, man. That show show must mean get out in another language because I I, I believe so. Get, get get your ass out of here, man. Show show yourself out, bro. Like seriously, donkey of the match has to go straight to Ollie. I'm frustrated, guy. I'm pissed off. I'm so pissed off that we actually got knocked out the Champions League. You know, out in the group stage. I I, I don't know what he has to say. Idiot. But yeah, guys, straight up. Next match, man, see, I don't know. It's going to be peak. It's peak for us. It's really, really peak for us, guys. <laughs> Let's just hope that we go to... Ma to wait, wait, we're playing at home. God. Even if we're playing at home, we have a poor record at home on the Wally. So, boy, remember to subscribe to Red United, guys, because I'm frustrated. Let me know exactly who your donkey of the match was. Let me know of your thoughts of the match as well. Let me know exactly what you thought of the tactics and everything. But guys, remember to also follow the Red United account on Instagram, which is Red United TV one You can also follow me on Ivorian underscore Spice on the Instagram, same as the Twitter as well, and also on the Snapchat, guys. Remember, guys, try keep it United as much as you can. <laughs> it's not easy. It's not easy. God bless our souls. And remember to keep it Red United because I'm out. I'm going to bed. I'm, I'm, screw this. <laughs>